just another red light. I think we've copped pretty much every red light between Bensdale and Melbourne, I think, this trip. Shall we begin? Let's begin now. So here in Melbourne, uh, going down to the cricket tonight, by we, I mean me and Chris, is walking there. Uh, you can see the stadium over the back there, but we are going against where everyone else is going because we're gonna go get some food. Starving. This good Samaritan said, we must take the stairs. He knows what it's all about. Yeah, so the Renegades lost, which wasn't great. It's by a fair bit, actually. So we're just sitting here waiting for the train to arrive in about 10 minutes. Yeah, so we're just sitting here, train will arrive in about 10 minutes. Chris has got some uh, ice cream, he's dabbing there. Uh, I'm sticking with my theme of how I said earlier in the week I'm not going to have any ice cream for the rest of the week so my, as my own punishment but it's a good punishment it's like a reward I get blueberries and turkey because I'm a little bit low on my protein intake today so um, yeah so Renegade's lost not great but as I'm ruined our night he's loving his ice cream It's a ghost train. <laughs> so we just got off the train, about to get back in the car and drive to the place we're staying tonight. It is 11.45 p.m. clearly. 11.45 and it's still 30 degrees. Singlet weather. Where's your singlet? This dab. I don't know how I feel about that. Let's Morning everyone. So we're on the train. Um, on the way home, taking public transport today because Chris brought me down to Melbourne yesterday. Went to the cricket last night, which was so much fun. And then I'm on the way back today. So uh, I've stopped in at a cafe and got my soy milk for my shake and if I can I'll just grab it from down here uh, good enough to give me some hot water for my tea as well I just find coffee first thing in the morning I don't know whether it's the milk or I don't know, I'm not sure where it is but <laughs> coffee first thing in the morning just makes me feel blah for the rest of the day I know that some people really rely on it and I was one of those people that used to really rely on it for energy and all that kind of stuff but I don't know, it just doesn't do it for me anymore. So the herbal tea, first thing in the morning, and shake as well. So let's get on the road, let's go home. So I'm home from Melbourne, uh, just going for a ride now. You can see the bike just here, and I'm in my gear. So this is my first ride in a while, so I'll see how I go. I'm only gonna go for a quick one just while it's uh, while it's still nice and sunny outside, so yeah.
That was just a quick tear around town. Bike one, Ed zero. Seriously, just a quick little 300 calorie burn around town. And I think you can see it. I am sweating. That, that was quick. <laughs> and it's still like 30 degrees outside. I know I've got my wreath up still. We're, we're still taking down Christmas decorations. Just, it'll come down probably before this video goes up. Once again, a beautiful night down here in East Gippsland. Looking out at that. Not too bad of a view. We've got our skewers here tonight. The tea. We got this as a present from my uh, from my auntie for Christmas. This is the first time we've used it. So, chicken, capsicum, and tomato and zucchini, all on skewers. Look delicious. And we're just going to have a side of beans with those tonight. So keeping it keeping it really light, keeping it really lean. We're just trying to cut back on a lot of the like heavy carbs and all that kind of stuff. Eat. This is not a drill. morning everyone so I've had my my brekkie this morning my normal oats shake tea that kind of stuff I took you through the other day and I've just cleaned up around the house a little bit so now is my chance to jump on the foam roller we had someone come straight over yesterday after I did my ride and so I neglected the stretch I just completely forgot about it woke up this morning going that was a bad choice. <laughs> you know, it was my first ride in a while, so my body hadn't really, you know, it was just like, what have you done to us? And you haven't even stretched. So normally, normally, what I would try and do is, you know, if we're just lounging around of an evening, unwinding, um, rather than sitting on the couch, rather than sitting on that comfy couch right there, I'll jump on the ground and do some stretching and, and some foam rolling, just roll over the areas, it'll a little bit sore. It's got like a bit of a massage every night, which is quite nice. But um, initially when I started weight training and resistance training, I, I really neglected the foam rolling. I neglected the whole flexibility stretching thing. I just got so focused on the weights and how much I could lift and all that kind of stuff. And I just didn't have any balance about what I was doing. You know, typically training the, the beach body style thing I suppose like trying to trying to train what I could see which is very post uh, very very anterior very front on neglecting my posterior my, like my back and all that kind of stuff and glutes and um, that didn't really serve me well going through I was a hockey player so going through a lot of development um, squads and all that kind of stuff and up with a lot of soft tissue injuries and eventually ended up with um, stress fractures with which caused me to stop after I was you know, in trials for the under 21 state team for Victoria. So jumping on the foam roller ever since and really working on focusing on my flexibility has helped so much in being able to, you know, create new PBs, smash new PBs, especially in things like, like squats and all that kind of stuff. My lower leg development, or my, sorry, my leg development, my lower body development is really something that I'm focusing on now to try and Try and increase my athleticism, but not only that, my also my my physique, I suppose. Like everyone, you know, you don't, I, I really don't want to be one of those people that ends up with the reasonably muscular upper body, and um, which is obviously what I'm working towards. Um, and then just having no no legs, like you got to have that balance. I heard this saying: um, the tree only grow, grows as tall and as strong as its roots will allow. So get these get these guys all healthy and um, and bigger and you know you'll see those advances in your upper body as well but for now I'm just gonna jump straight on this hopefully it can help relieve some tension and some soreness in my legs
I don't know what it is about foam rolling, but it just makes me, just gets me all sweaty. I don't know whether it's like having to hold yourself in that position or I'm just, I'm not sure, but whatever it is about foam rolling, every time I finish like five, 10, 15 upwards minutes of foam rolling, I'm sweating. So I just got here to the gym and look who it is. Hey. Hi. Hi, ready to have a good gym session? Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Mm -hmm. So today we've got chest and triceps. It's only going to be a quick one today, so I better get into it, but I'm just going to do every single set is a superset. Start off with my warm up and bench press and then head straight into my supersets. So I'll show you a little bit what that's about. It's a cable to a half cable press. So trying to work on the underside of the chest. Trying to bring elbow, elbow right down to the front there. So here we go. So that's it for this vlog guys, hope you got something out of it, whether it was uh, you're enjoying going with me on my day to day things or if you really like the gym stuff or if you want to see a bit more diet stuff, make sure you let me know down in the comments below. Uh, I've got a really exciting few days coming up in Adelaide, heading over there not tomorrow, the next day. So that'll be so much fun to get over there and show you guys what I get up to. So definitely come with me on that one because you will not want to miss it. Please like, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. The stuff you have to do down below and make sure you share this video with someone if you enjoyed it and you felt like we connected because I really feel like we're starting to create a bit of a bond now. I think it's really good. So thanks guys and I'll see you again soon. Bye. It's fun. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> okay, start now. But in all honesty, it's really fun. <laughs>